You lied to me. I was a kid. You promised you'd keep me safe. And then you make a deal with Azazel. Yeah, it saved Dad's life. But I'll tell you something else that happened. Because on November 2nd, 1983, Old Yellow Eyes came waltzing into Sammy's room because of your deal. I'm gonna stand over their crib and I'm gonna bleed into their mouth. I've got demon blood in me, Dean. This disease pumping through my veins and I can't ever rip it out or scrub it clean. I'm a whole new level of freak. You left us. Alone. You know, when you die, you change that. His dad was just a shell. The hunter life, it just took him over. I guess I was the same. Me? I know I'm a freak. And sooner or later, everybody's gonna leave me. I had to be. More than just a brother, I had to be a father. And I had to be a mother. To keep him safe. The truth is, Watching out for you. It's gonna go to my job, you know? I had to look out for you. That's my job. More than that, it's, it's kind of who I am. It's like I had one job. I had one job. And I screwed it up. And that wasn't fair. I guess that's what I do. And I let down the people I love. And I couldn't do it. Knights of the Round Table. At all King Arthur's knights, and they were all on the quest for the Holy Grail. And I remember looking at this picture of Sir Galahad, and, and, and he was kneeling. And, and light streaming over his face. And I remember thinking, um, I could never go on a quest like that. Because I'm not clean. And you want to know what that was like? They killed the girl that he loved. He got possessed by Lucifer. They tortured him in hell. And he lost his soul. His soul. Oh, because of you. I mean, I, I, I was just a little kid. You think... Maybe I knew? I mean, deep down, that... I had... Demon blood in me. And about the evil of it. You know, when Dean came to get me at school, I told myself, one last job, you know, one more job. When Dad disappeared, Sam and I looked around and something became very clear. There's always one more job, you know, one more job, one more job. And then I would go back to law and to my life. But the only thing we had in this world, the only thing, aside from this car, was each other. Sam, it's okay. It's okay. I'm here. I'm here. I'm not gonna leave you. I'm not gonna leave you. I can't do this alone. I can't do it without you. Yes, you can. Yeah. Well, I don't want to. But I can't do it without my brother. I don't want to do it without my brother. And if he's gone, then I don't... I couldn't let him die, Bobby. I couldn't. He's my brother. I hate you. I hate you. And I love you. When I was a kid, 
What did you always tell me when you put me to bed? Dean, I don't understand. Just answer the question. I told you angels were watching over you. Because I can't, I can't help it. You're my mom. You're my big brother. There's nothing I wouldn't do for you. And I understand. Because I have made deals to save the ones I love. What did you do? It's okay, Dean. It's gonna be okay. I mean, I've been looking up to you since I was four, Dean. Studying you, trying to be just like my big brother. So yeah, I know you. Don't you dare think that there is anything, past or present, that I would put in front of you. It has never been like that, ever. I need you to see that. I'm begging you. I've been the one out there, messed up and scared and alone. And Dean did whatever he could to save you. Dean, you're all I've got. So of course, I was gonna fight for you because that's what we do. When are you gonna realize it's over? There's nothing to fight for. You have changed. And you tell people it's not a big deal. You tell people you'll work through it. But you know you won't. You see a light at the end of this ugly-ass tunnel. I don't. You can't. And that scares the hell out of you. My plan is to fight. My plan is to try. My plan is to give a damn. Are you telling me there's nothing? Huh? Are you telling me there's nothing to fight for? That there's nothing to hope for? Sam keeps trying to fix it, but I just keep dragging him down. I see light at the end of this tunnel. And if you come with me, I can take you to it. Because you are my brother. And I'm here to take you home. We'll figure it out. Just like we always do. We always do. Damn right. Let it go, okay? Let it go, brother. So what's it all led up to? It's hard to say. But me, I'd say this was a test. For Sam and Dean. I'm proud of us. And I think they did all right. Up against good, evil, Angels, devils, destiny, and God himself. They made their own choice. They chose family. And, well, isn't that kind of the whole point?